Hello, this is Rebecca here with Create with Rebecca, and I'm back today with another video to show you how I'm going to be documenting my day in a life. Um, this is a class, or a not a class, but a, like a follow along by Allie Edwards. She does um, the week in a life, which I just did a video yesterday on, and I showed that how I used my traveler's notebook back in May on documenting um, my week in a life. And so tomorrow, which is Saturday, July 30th, that she's also going to do it a follow along and you can join in uh, documenting your whole day. So I went back and forth on how I was going to do it. I mean, you could use a traveler's notebook, but I decided that since I've been documenting my daily life, my everyday in my happy planner, I just decided to go ahead and use my happy planner for um, documenting the day in a life. And so, what it is, is we have, so this is the 30th, which is tomorrow and Saturday, and I went, and I had these actually on hand, these are the inserts that are put out by Happy Planner, they came with a packet, and so I'm just going to use these to um, document, which, what I mean by document is I'm going to be adding photos, I'm going to be adding journaling, and, um, you know, maybe some, etc., so... What I did was I went on to Allie Edwards' website, and I was just kind of looking to see how she plans on documenting her day in a life just to get some inspiration, and I did. She's going to set her alarm um, for every hour to take to stop, take a photo, and write what she's doing. Now, on Saturday, I know I'm going to be driving quite a bit because I have um, some things in Austin, including a planner meetup, and so I know that I won't be able to quite write, stop and write, but... I will be carrying around a notebook with me to document the pictures or a lot of times I can hopefully uh, remember what's going on but um, but what I did take from it is she had created different um, inserts or different pages that had the times on there so I went in and made these little circle times and so what I plan on doing is if I take a picture um, or documentation I can come in here and add this and maybe write in a story or put a picture in. So that's my idea behind it. Now how I made these little circles, and you know my stamping isn't perfect, but it's kind of like, I've kind of gotten over that. I kind of like being a little bit, I mean stamping is to me is kind of, okay maybe not for everybody, but in the artsy part of me it's like it's okay if it's not exactly totally feel, I used to not throw everything away if it wasn't perfect. and. It's really hard to get sometimes have everything perfect when you're stamping. But what I did was I took my circle paper, my cardstock that I've used a lot to make dividers and planners, and I just punched those out using my one and a half inch punch. And then I went in and used, I know, don't judge on the, um, oh, yeah, I've got a mess going on here. But this <laughs> this is my uh, clear acrylic block that I use for stamping. And yes, I just stamped, so I've got a big mess here. But um, this was actually a stamp, I think, put out by Happy Scrappy. She did a class on using a traveler's notebook to document. And so with that class, if you registered early, you got a set of stamps. So this kind of came with it. But it gave me the idea to use these to stamp on the circles. And then you had your your time at the top and then you could put like um, like in this case I put a little stamp of a little car because I know that I'm going to be driving at 10 a.m. because that's what time I have to leave to get into town what I mean by town is Austin so and then let me see if I can find I'd stamped a couple other ones like <clears throat> excuse me um, oh here we go 7 a.m. I stamped a clock you know 8 a.m. the sun so, you know, I left some of them blank because I plan on coming in here, maybe not necessarily with a stamp, but maybe with, like, this is where I was, or this is what I was doing, or something like that. But I really like this idea uh, from Allie to, you know, use your, have a time set, so I'll be setting my, my phone alarm, and um, using a notebook to document what I take a picture of, or, you know, try to remember that. Uh, exactly what I want to document and then I'll come in here and print my pictures out and add them to these inserts so once I have it all said and done I'll do another video and show you a flip through of how that was documented the other thing um, I 
I'm going to plan on using, I have a ton of these, you know, I love snap products, um, and I love just all these kind of items here. I'm such a fanatic for stuff like this cute little house. This would be perfect maybe in here, you know, for the home or something like that. But anyway, I plan on using a lot of these up because I have a ton of them. So yeah, it's going to be fun. I'm really looking forward to it. Um, because, hey, you know, it's fun to document. I love, I'm a scrapbooker, and so this is fun for me. But anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video. And hopefully have this ready to go um, next week. Thanks for watching.